Hey everybody, Rick Needham handicapping thoroughbred racing from my hometown track, Penn National Racecourse, Grandville, Pennsylvania, on Friday evening, December the 30th. And this is my day at the track.com race of the day. Let's take a look at race 5 this evening, folks. 7.38 p.m. Eastern Post Time, 6 furlong sprint on the dirt, 3 year olds and up race for an allowance prize of some $32,000. Contenders number 2, Andy Oatley. Number seven, New Revolution. Number three, Roderick. And number one, Gentleman John. Number two, Andy Oakley is both the overall speed and pace profile leader in this allowance field, sprinting at today's distance of six furlongs on the dirt. Has nice early speed abilities also to complement for this sprint. It's undefeated in a two race career to date, winning both in power run fashion. Jockey Edwin Nevado was in his irons for both of those wins en route to more than a thousand percent return on investment in the process is back today for ride number three gunning for a hat trick win number seven new revolution a 10 to 1 bomb has hit the board in four of his last five winning in his fifth race back race five summary number two andy oatley tops my contenders list which also includes number seven new revolution number three roderick and number one gentleman john 2731 in the fifth from penn national a couple of bonus long shots via the ponder on a Friday night, Charlestown, race four, number four, Kane City, a 10 to 1 bomb, the speed leader in this climbing field, racing at or about tonight's distance of eight and a half furlongs on the dirt. Hawthorne, race four, number nine, Clocker Bob, a four to one shot, Trackmaster plus Power Pony qualifier, nice overall speed for this six furlong sprint. So from Penn National on a Friday night, Rick Needham for dayatthetrack.com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.